What's up everybody? It's Luke James, not the singer. If you're looking to get your music reviewed, you can hit up this email that's right here. But today I'm going to hit you up with my thoughts and opinions on this EP from Leo West called Somewhere West. Now Leo West is a rapper who's coming out of Chicago, and if you want to find out more about him and check out his music, all you gotta do is take a look at the links down below. But as for this project right here, it's a very short affair with only six tracks, including the radio drop intro called Sunrise on 290, so there's not going to be a whole lot to break down here since it's such a short project. It's under 13 minutes in length, but even still, within that time frame, Leo shows a lot of potential and versatility. I especially like the title track with those triumphant horns and the dope-ass beat drop, as Leo is on here working sing-songy flows about his come up and aspirations and I actually think he's at his best when he's making these more smooth bright and fun tracks one of my favorites in particular is Coltrane where his verses float over the big bass and jazz piano with ease this track by fire is my favorite song on the whole album so make sure you check it out there's also a video for it and it also has a bright and catchy hook on here really just a great song all around low-key a track that I think could catch a lot of traction if enough people hear it so make sure you check that out and to be clear it's not just these smooth style tracks that you're going to get from Leo, because he knows how to make quality bangers as well, man. The song Lessons, for example, is an all-out trunk slapper, so make sure you put that one in rotation in your car, because this got bass much, much thicker than Leighton Benton, or Rose Monroe was the name I often use. I know a lot of you guys got love for her, so we'll shout her out right quick. Uh, you're also going to get some catchy, charismatic flows from Israel on this song. Leo is showcasing a rapid style that works really well. I think these two just show a lot of chemistry and energy on this track, so hopefully they work together more in the future because I think there's a lot of potential to do more there. And while there's not much to break down here when it comes to complex lyricism and deep content, I kind of alluded to this earlier because this is such a short project, you still get a couple of moments that shows Leo can get into that if he wants to. I'm Back, for example, has him reflecting on hard times when he was sleeping on floors and working out of trap houses, but this would also be one of my least favorite tracks. I think the beat here is the weakest one on the project. It's not trash, it's just the weakest. And then with the song Time Again, Leo was reflecting on people he lost to the streets, beef, and suicide. Very personal track there as well, and he also speaks on the racism that pervades society on this song. So there are some good things to be said here on some of these tracks. I just think when it comes time for a full-length release, he's going to be able to expand on his ideas, maybe get a bit more creative with his concepts, just to leave more of an impact. But even still, as it is, this is a dope EP that I'm going to give a 7 out of 10 to. It's definitely worth your time. I just look forward to hearing more, because then I think I can really go with a higher rating once I get the full thing, because this is kind of like the appetizer, got to see what the main course is like, but even still, he showcases versatility, his ability overall, uh, there's just a lot of fun showcased on this EP. You got that banger lessons, some of those smooth joints, Coltrane, as I mentioned, is a fucking dope-ass track, I'd love to hear more of that style from him, I think that's him at his best. But yeah, man, check this one out, I think a lot of you might be surprised by it, let me know how you feel about it in the comments section, and of course, make sure you do that good YouTube and social media stuff where you show me love and you show me lots of of it. Thank you for watching everybody. I will see you next time.